Hi, this is Yolanda Van Veen, and in this segment, we're going to talk about planting dahlia bulbs. Now, this particular dahlia I put in a pot in the spring, and it bloomed all summer long, and it just got huge. And it's so beautiful, it has these beautiful purple flowers on it that were just gorgeous all summer, and they were much more vibrant when they had the bright sun on them. It's now end of November, and they still have the last blooms just fell off. So I'm going to um, t dig it out of the pot, which I have, and I'm going to divide it up and put it into a few pots. But as you can see, this stem is just huge. So I'm going to cut it off, and then this is just going to go in my compost pile because it will make good compost. And now this dahlia is a huge bulb. And as you can see, there's many, many, many tubers on it. But they all meet at the center. So it's very difficult to separate it out without losing some of the eyes. So you can't just pull the eyes off, because if you just pull them off, you're losing part of the stem. So at this point, too, I'm going to just, let me see if I can even separate any of these out, because I don't want to lose them. But if you pull them out, see, you don't have the eyes. And you need the eyes. So the only way to keep the eyes is to cut this down to the ground, to the close as possible. So scissors aren't even going to cut it. I'm going to need to have a knife. So when you take the knife, you need to just cut it right down the middle. And you can take it four ways. Because you need part of that trunk for the bulb to survive. You can't just plant it with just the root itself. It needs that eye. Saying that, though, I have planted some of the roots just by themselves, and they have grown. So even if you do um, break them off, you still plant them. So the trick with dahlias is to plant them right away. I could leave them dry, too. I can leave them in a box or keep them in a newspaper or compost or a straw and just leave them for the winter and then plant them in the spring. But I'll just put them back into pots. And so I can divide that into four different plants and put them in four different pots. And that way I'll have gorgeous, gorgeous dahlias next summer.